In this video I'm going to show you how to set up forms with Follow-up Boss using a free service called JotForm and you can use this to replace contact us forms on your website or if you're building a landing page they have really flexible options for that as well. So the first thing to do is in your Follow-up Boss account uh, hover over your name and go to my settings and get your unique Follow-up Boss email address. So it's going to look like this and if you're in a team account you will also be able to find that on the user's screen and you'll also have the option of a round robin email address. Now if, it's, if you send the leads to the round robin email address they will obviously be distributed in a round robin fashion and if you send the leads to a person's specific email address for example uh, we're going to use Mary's here and we're going to copy this email address and this is the one we're going to use to send leads to the, the leads will be assigned directly to Mary. So we head on over to jotform.net and we're going to click sign up or if there's a pop-up just choose create an account. And now we're going to start building our form. So first we'll put in uh, the name field, we'll put in email address, phone number and let's put in a place for a message. So if we go to form tools and choose text area. Um, you can type message or whatever you like there. Um, submit button, so yeah you, you could edit this if it's on a landing page to say something like send me my free report. But this is the basics you know for replacing a you know a contact form. You can make fields required, to do that you just click this required icon. So I'm going to make email address required and then click setup and embed and this is where we're going to set up the link to follow up boss so we're going to select email alerts and notification and then choose switch to text mode now I'm going to get the default follow up boss uh, you know email passing format from our help article which will be located near this video so I'm going to copy that and I'm going to paste it into JotForm. And then I'm going to choose, get these uh, little fields from JotForm and put, line them up with the dummy data which is from the follow-up boss email parser. So for example I'm going to take this full name one and replace John Smith. And that means when someone fills out the form that's going to be replaced with their actual name. So just do the same thing for email address, phone number, we don't have a price in this case so we're just going to remove that field and here is where we will put the uh, web address so you could put in you know wherever you're getting this lead from so it will be tracked separately in follow up boss and you'll be able to target them in MailChimp or you know with different kinds of follow up and any extra fields you're going to want to put under the notes so any ones that aren't covered already by these they'll be in the notes and so they'll still be sent through to you and put into follow up boss. So then delete all this uh, information at the bottom and just check your reply to and recipient settings. So the recipient email should be your follow up boss lead email address and it already is by default because I signed up using this email address but if you signed up using your own email address you'll need to make sure to change this over to be the follow up boss email address. Choose finish and now we can test out the form. So if we click uh, save and we're going to press preview. Then we'll just fill it in and press submit. Now you can have a look in your follow-up boss and make sure that that lead has come through. So here we can see we just got um, this lead. Notice how all the you know the email, the phone number has come through and the source which we added in there, my awesome website. And if we click into the lead we'll also be able to click on this form submission here and it's going to give us all that information including the notes. 
So back in JotForm, just a few other handy things you can do is uh, resize the form so you can you can change all the styling over here. And they have different themes that you know to make it match your website. And you know when you're happy with what you find, just click save. And then click uh, set up and embed and click this little source code icon. Now co you'll copy this code and put this in your website. So whether it's WordPress or you know any other website, you will just replace your existing form with this code. So you'll copy this, give this to your website designer if you need to, or the person that handles that stuff for you, or just change it over, um, you know, just by deleting the old form and by you know putting this one in there. And that's it. You might like to give your form a name as well. And that's everything for getting into Follow Up Boss. You can get a bit more advanced if you want, so adding in, you know, drop downs and radio buttons and everything. But JotForms, you know, a great free program. You can add in a number of forms, and you're just limited to 100 submissions a month. So after that, I think you'll need to upgrade your account. If you need any help with forms, just contact us, support at followupboss.com. And we can help you out with doing this and you'll just need to put this little code um, onto your website.